Hello guys, it's Nay. Today we're gonna be doing a Pika Pika X review. That's like some, I think, Mexican candy. I don't really know. It's like dipped in chamoy and tahin. I don't know. That's what I've heard. So I ordered the 20 ounce variety pack from their website and it comes with Skittles, Nerds, Sour Patch, Watermelons, Airheads, Panda, Gusanos, Gushers, Roll-Ups, Sour Patch Straws. So when I open this, I'm gonna be showing you guys everything in detail. But if you're new to my channel, my name is Nay. I do videos, I just started. Um, like my videos, share my videos, subscribe to my channel. And yeah, we're gonna get into this video and I'm gonna try some good candy. But before I do that, I wanna brag because it's my birthday. These are my birthday nails. Done by um, Solange at La Pearl Nails. Well, it's not La Pearl Nails, La Pearl Studios. I'll tag their Instagram because she does really good nails. These are my birthday presents that my boo gave me. One. Two, beautiful shoes. I know you guys like them. Let me know what you think about my presents in the comments. Are they beautiful? I know they are. You don't have to tell me. It's okay. It's okay. No, no, I'm not no. even gonna run, but they're so cute. I didn't to <laughs> more because I have my own, even though I know maybe theirs is different. But I'm gonna be using my own chamoy. Cause my mom bought a whole gallon. So, can't let it go to waste, right? I'm gonna open my box. Don't even try to look at my address because I scratched it off. And if you know where I live, don't come to my house. Ever. Yeah, I can't even open this box. Um, packaging people, whoever shipped me this. Shit's mad hard to open, why? Oh my god, the box is so cute. Why they put it in this big ass box when it's a small ass box? Oh, but they gave me a cute little card. Let me see what this is. Hold up. Oh. Oh, let me tell you the price because I guess you guys would be interested in that, right? The total price was... The price for the box itself is $16.75. But plus shipping is $7.75. So the discount they were having basically made it equal the same exact thing. So the total was $24.50. This is their little card that they send. It's so cute. I think every business should send something like this just to promote themselves. That's their Instagram right here. Before I open this little box, cute, adorable little box, I'm gonna pour some of my chamoy in this cute little bowl. I only put a little bit because I'm only going to be trying. It's not like I'm going to be dogging down this whole thing. I'm going to open this real quick and then I'll show you guys what's inside. Okay. I guess each bag is like how many ounces? Two ounces each bag. That's pretty good, I would say, for the price. This one is. Well, actually, it doesn't say. Um, I feel like they should put what each one is in case you don't want to open the wrong one. But, you know, I don't really mind. Oh, this one has it. Why does this one not have it? This one says punch. So I'm assuming that the punch is sour punch straws. And then, yeah, they all have it. I don't know why this one doesn't have it. This one says pandas. So I'm assuming that's the pandas, right? Nerds. I like how this one is red. Gusanos. Yes, I speak Spanish. In case you're new to my channel. This one also doesn't have it. I guess they probably just fell off or something. This is the watermelons. I'm not a watermelon person, but... Skittles. Gushers. I also hate gushers, but I will try it for you guys. 
and Sour Patch. These are absolutely my favorite. I'm gonna start with the ones I don't like so that if I really don't like it, I could get the disgusting taste out of my mouth. I'm gonna start with Gushers. The bags are really cute. And they have their little sticker on there with their Instagram tag right there. That's really nice. Nice way to promote. Oh God. Watch me struggle to open these packages. You're welcome. I'm gonna dip it. I'm gonna try it first without it and then with it and tell you guys if the chamoy makes a difference and if I even like it at all. Yeah, I'm just not a gushers person. <laughs> that shit was nasty. <laughs> Actually awful. I wish I wouldn't have spit it out in the cute little box. I'm gonna also try it with chamoy, yay. Maybe it'll make it better. Uh-uh. This is one is when it explodes. <laughs> that was I'm not gonna blame it on them. I just don't like gushers. If you like gushers, I guess 10 out of 10. For me, zero. Eight gushers. This is the watermelons. Oh, I'm gonna struggle for real. And then I'm not a watermelon fan, that's why I'm starting with the ones I don't like. Oh, I usually do like sour watermelons. Not much, but I don't mind them. Uh, not bad. With the chamoy. Um. Without the chamoy, I give it a 7 out of 10. With the chamoy, I give it a 9. The chamoy makes it a lot better. It's amazing. <laughs> this is, oh no, Sour Pass is my favorite. We're going to do them last. I'm going to go for the punch because I don't really know what these are. It says on the page, it says Sour Punch Straw. I don't really, I never had those, so I'm gonna go for it. Oh, they're like mad long. I'm gonna just try half. Oh no, never mind. It's okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try half and then half in there. Um, it's really good. I'm gonna dip it in my chamoy. also good i would say with the chamoy a 10 out of 10 without it a 9.5 no nine i just feel like the chamoy makes it a lot better stop dipping into my chamoy i'm gonna go for one of the surprise packages because i have no idea what the fuck is in here and maybe i won't like it and i don't want this to be the last taste in my mouth and I will not be eating these after this. Well, I will, but just not today because it is 12.40 a.m. And I need to go to sleep. I'm leaving those for last. Yo, this is hard. Is it just me that be sure? Oh, shit. This is like a roll. Mm, like a roll up. Did it say that it was going to have that? I don't know. I'm not going to check right now. But... I'm not gonna eat the whole roll up. I'm only gonna try a little bit. Um, it's really not all that. Not a fan of the roll up too much. Without the chamoy, I say a five out of ten. 
with the tamoy that's six not much of a difference i just this is not really nothing i don't know doesn't tickle anything for me I'm gonna go with the other mystery one because they didn't put the name so i have no idea what it is Oh, I like these. I don't really know what these are. I don't know the name. Because they didn't put it. But I'm gonna assume. Just assume these are. Nerd? No. I really don't know. It had extremes, I'm assuming. I'm gonna try half. Because I don't wanna overeat. 1240. It's good. But I feel like the chamoy is going to make it a lot better. Yeah. Chamoy made it better. Without the chamoy, it's uh, 7. With the chamoy, I would say like 8.5. Though the chamoy brings it up like 1.5 points for me. I'm going to try the pandas because I also don't think I ever had these. Yeah, opening things is difficult and trust me I've had longer nails than this so it's not the nails that's the problem oh these are so cute super cute it's like the little panda bear mm, very very chewy well it's a gummy so obviously duh Letting my little bear swim in there. Mm. Chamoy just makes it so much better. Use chamoy. Okay, so without it, um, I don't know what to give it. I would say a six out of ten. With the chamoy, Eight. Definitely eight. Maybe because I soaked it so much and I love chamoy. I don't know. But it's really good. I'm going to go into the gusanos. Damn, this is mad deep. Got to put my whole hand in there. Very sticky. I don't think these are sour underneath. I only like sour gummy worms. So for me, without the chamoy, that was already like a four. With the chamoy, only a five. I'm really not a fan of things that aren't sour. I'm gonna do, should I do nerds or Skittles? I'll do nerds. Yo, when I blow up, I'm gonna be asking y'all questions like that. Like, should I do this or this? Cause right now, I don't even got no followers, bro. If I ask a question, ain't nobody gonna answer me. I'm gonna break this. Oh my God, this shit is too long. I'm just gonna break a fucking tiny piece. Oh, little tiny piece. Oh my God, I swear too much. Whoops. Hard to break. Take that into consideration. I'm gonna have to clean this mess so my mom don't beat my ass. Lord Jesus. <coughs> I'm dipping it into this chamoy. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm. This is actually good. But it's so hard to break. Like, is it worth making this mess? I mean, kinda, yeah. I would say with the chamoy, 10 out of 10. Without it, 8.5. Mm, maybe 9. Um, 9, yeah, 9. 
But this mess, I don't know. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. You let me know. Cause probably you're supposed to just dip the whole thing, but I'm not gonna eat the whole thing in one bite. Like, I don't know. This is a tiny little ball of Skittle. Oh, my teeth almost broke. Very, very hard to chew. Unless you got very strong teeth. I'm not gonna grab an orange. Maybe the different colors have a different flavor. I'm gonna grab a red. Or what I think is a red. Because with all this on it, I don't even know. Completely covered. Oh my god. Yeah, it's so hard to chew. I'm not even lying, y'all. I don't know. Maybe it's because it's so hard to chew. I'm giving it a 6 without the chamoy and a 7 with the chamoy. And not even. I don't think I really tasted much of a difference, honestly. This is my last little pouch. Oh. Here's Sour Patches, my favorite. My favorite is blue. I don't know if they have blue in here. Yo, oh, right here, blue one. I'm only, on, only gonna eat half. That's good. That's good. Mm. With and without. 10 out of 10. Absolutely 10 out of 10. My favorite. Maybe I'm biased because I like Sour Patches so much. But 10 out of 10. I'm going to tell you guys. I'm going to rate these. I'm going to put them in the order from my least favorite to most favorite. Even though... I don't even remember which mystery one was which. But I'm just gonna give it a name and we're gonna pretend that that's the one. Okay, so my very favorite, my number one, where's my number one? Was Sour Patch, number one. If you're only getting a one bag, even though this is more affordable. But if you just want to get that one flavor, that one candy bag, um, Sour Patch should be your go-to. My second one is the Nerds Rope. Where is that? Nerds, right here. This is my second favorite. Um, if you don't like Sour Patches, go for this one. My third... Honestly, what was my third? I think one of the mystery ones, but I don't know which one it was. I'm gonna say sour punch straws. I don't know if this is the one, but we're gonna assume that this is the one and pretend it is. That's my number three. My number four was um, Airhead. That's one of the mystery ones again. They didn't put the name. Airheads. And my number five, I don't know, maybe it's just me. I didn't really enjoy the other ones. I'll say pandas, I guess. The other ones is just not my cup of tea. But if you guys like it, the Skittles are good. They're just really hard. The Gushers, not a Gushers fan. This is like my absolute bottom. That's awful. Um, gummy worms, if they were sour, Amazing. They're not sour, so um, I don't like it. The roll-ups, I don't like it. It doesn't really have a flavor to me. I mean, it has the flavor that they put on it, but the candy itself, it doesn't taste like anything, so I don't like it. Watermelons. Um, I mean, it was good. I'm not going to lie. It was good, but I don't like it. That's it. They brought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten bags. It was six, sixteen seventy-five without shipping. 
So when you include shipping, it's seven extra dollars, a little over, depending on where you live, probably. Um, but I think the bag is the box is worth it. If you're just doing something like a little video review, or you're just having some friends over and you wanna get a little candy party box, whatever, cute. Um, I personally, I probably will shop from them again in the future because I do like the candy, but I'll probably not order this box even though it's a more more affordable options. I mean, if I do find people that like this in my family, I will probably will keep ordering this box because it's the most affordable thing on their website and I live for affordable, so. I'll probably keep ordering if my friends and family like it and I could just give them that, the ones I don't like. But personally, I only like about half of the ones that came in the box. So if my family doesn't really enjoy it, I probably won't be ordering this box again. I'll just order the ones that I like separately. That's going to be it for the video. If you have tried these, let me know below. Tell me what you thought of it. Tell me what each flavor was like to you. What you rated. You know, leave whatever comments you want to leave. Say hi. Say bye. I don't know. Um, share my video. Like my video. Subscribe to my channel. Please subscribe. I only have 57 subscribers and you guys are watching my videos and not subscribing. Like, why do you do that? Why would you want to watch my videos and not subscribe to me? Just don't watch my videos. If you're not going to subscribe, don't watch me. You're so rude. You make me feel so sad. You hurt my feelings. So, subscribe to my channel. And like my videos. I see that a lot of people have watched my videos and you don't even like it. Like, I want other people to see my videos, so like it. I don't want to just be a dead YouTuber. I want people to like me on YouTube and share my videos so that I could get big on YouTube. So, that's it. If you guys um, live near me and you know me, not just if you don't know me and you want these candies, you can come pick them up, honestly. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not going to give them to you. I'm probably going to eat it even though I don't like it. <laughs> Bye!